Desktop computers inside a building within an enterprise are typically connected via data cabling to a computer room. A patch panel is used to interconnect all the users into a local area network, or LAN. The local area network allows the users to utilize shared resources and access corporate data stored inside the building or campus. Typically, this requires a server and some software that logically connect the users over the physical LAN cabling and hub. The need to connect the users of one LAN to another LAN across town is common. A company with two or more offices in a metropolitan area will eventually realize the value of sharing resources and important information across the enterprise. All buildings in a city are connected to the incumbent local exchange carrier, the ILEC. This is often a regional Bell operating company. The ILEC has copper cabling installed to all buildings. The copper cabling makes up the local telephone network and is interconnected at the phone company's central office by switches. The ILEC will typically have installed fiber optic cable to some buildings. Many buildings are also connected to the competitive local exchange carrier infrastructure. The competitive carrier, or CLEC, will typically install fiber optic technology into the buildings it services. This fiber rings a geographic area beginning and ending at the CLEC node. Inside the node, transmission equipment directs voice and data back and forth, interconnecting buildings outside the ring, including the phone company's CO, to points of presence, or POPs, in customer buildings. These POPs have special hardware that converts the optical signals transmitted across the fiber cables to electrical signals for transmission over the copper infrastructure inside the buildings. Additional hardware converts the metropolitan area protocols, like ATM, frame relay, and ISDN, to the Ethernet protocols commonly found on LANs. Many regions in a metropolitan area may be ringed in a similar way, allowing clusters of suburban office buildings to be connected to offices downtown. Major metropolitan areas often interconnect numerous cities or towns into a metroplex via fiber backbones to nodes and COs. At some point, this is interconnected to the inter-exchange carrier or IXC networks to go across the country. Here, the data leaves the metropolitan area network and moves across a wide area network. Together, the local area network, the metropolitan area network, and the wide area network allow the desktop to be connected to the world.